so I got the holiday update yesterday, which is um, 2020.48.26. Um, and I guess a few people were quite disappointed that it wasn't um, version 11. I guess I was too. Um, there is one really cool feature, which is uh, being able to kind of customize the horn and external speaker sounds for your car. Um, but I found out I can't do that on my car. I don't know if it's because it's a Model X or because I'm in the UK. Because uh, I've seen, I think I've seen some Model Threes in the UK where um, that feature is being disabled as well. Um, so yeah, that sucks a bit. The other things that have changed are the driver visualizations have changed slightly, um, and I think there are some changes to how it drives, um, as in full self drive seems to be kind of worse, like a bit more cautious and um, if anything I've noticed more phantom braking than there was before. Um, but yeah, let's go for a drive and we can see how it uh, handles. Okay, so we've got auto steer enabled. There's a lady in the middle of the road, so we'll see what it does about that. And it kind of slowed down for her, which was nice to see. doing fine so far it's saying stopping for traffic control in 400 feet it's going a little bit fast over those speed bumps it's doing fine on this turny bit uh, and we're going through the green lights because I, I acknowledged it with the stalk still needs okay and it thought that car was gonna smash into us and did a massive brake there which wasn't great Okay, it didn't like that roundabout so it told me to take over, no real surprises there but it, I don't know it seems a bit more panicky than it used to be. It's done that fine. getting on some faster roads soon so we should be able to try out how it does on those okay so we're on a 60 mile an hour road so let's see how it does bit of phantom braking there go by which was nice okay we're coming into a village speed limit's 30 it knows it's slowed down I guess the cars in front are slowed down anyway I think we might head up that hill okay it's doing this corner and it's right in the middle of the road and it gave up and it's allowing me to put autopilot on so we'll see how it does this this road is really narrow and let's just drop the speed down a good bit Okay, so far there's a big turn here, and it, yeah, it did it actually. Kind of slammed the brakes on, but it did it, and there was really like a split second for it to actually see the turn. So that's quite impressive. Okay, so the speed limit here is still 60, but no one in the right minds would be doing 60 around here, and doesn't do this can't know. So it didn't see the turn there, and it tried to drive into that house, which is lovely. <laughs> Will it do it? It didn't like it, but it just did it, and the lines kind of disappeared on the corner there, which was a bit of a challenge for it. I'm just going to drop the speed down to quite low. So this is the first one coming up. I think I think this one is the most narrow. There's a second one that's not quite so bad, but you see if it could follow what these cars are doing in front. Let's just drop it right down. See what it does. It's 
so it's coming up to it and it's steering right yeah that's okay what's it gonna do oh it did it that's amazing so that first dodge it did and then i kind of um panicked and took over as it already kind of got through it anyway okay uh, it's slowing down is it going to see that there's an archway and drive through it it's going round it's going round i just took over because it, it just seems to be so close to that wall yeah it kind of did it though kind of did the definitely did the first one okay yeah, it's seen the stop sign and is it going to stop of course it's going to stop But it didn't put the sign on the screen, which was disappointing. Damn it. Oh, come on. So there's a tight turn coming up now, so hopefully it'll slow itself down for it and actually make it. It's, I guess it's a bit tricky for it to spot that you have to turn here and not just drive down and straight on. And yeah, it tries to drive straight on. Okay, so it saw that person as a reindeer, that's good. <laughs> that's good. So yeah, that's it for today's video. Um, I'm sorry that it's probably quite a boring video, but I do like to see um, if the updates make any difference to the full self-drive, especially in the UK, where we're quite a bit behind our US friends. And I guess, if anything, um, I'm a bit disappointed with this update because actually it seems like things have gone slightly backwards. Uh, but anyway, like and subscribe and I'll see what else I can get from the car on this latest update.